Alright, hey guys, it's TJ, and welcome back to another video. So today I'm going to be talking about something that's really, really creepy. Um, I wasn't going to make a video because I'm kind of sick, as you might be able to tell, but then I heard about this on Instagram, the Philip DeFranco show, uh, like just the news and stuff. Like, creepy stuff is happening, guys. This is going to be creepy for anyone, but if you're creeped out by clowns, like my dad is, like he's especially creeped out by clowns, this is not good news for you. Basically, I don't know if you guys have heard about this, but it is so intense. There have been clown sightings across America. Like, like, that's so creepy. Like, I'm not particularly creeped out by clowns. Like, certain clowns, like ones in movies and stuff where they're supposed to be creepy, obviously they creep me out. Hold on, I don't look smart enough. You guys can't take me seriously. One second. One of you guys commented saying, like, why haven't you been wearing your glasses? And it, like, I've completely forgot about my glasses lately. So, I'll show some pictures here, but, like, there are clown sightings all over America. What? That's so creepy. Like, they're just standing there and reportedly they're trying to like lure women and children into forests. That's like a horror game, like the beginning of a horror movie or a horror game. Some kids walk into his first day of school and then you just got a clown there with like balloons. Like, ah, that's so creepy. Like a clown just chilling there with balloons and then and then he's like, come on kid, let's go into the, like it's so creepy. And I'm sure like some of the clown sightings aren't real. People are just like, once they heard about this, they're reporting clowns everywhere. But like the first couple I are legit, like there's pictures. Legit clowns trying to lure people into forests to do, ugh. Imagine seeing that. You're walking back from your friend's house late at night, taking out the garbage, anything. And you just see a clown standing there, like chilling. That's like, that's the worst. Dude, I also just realized like trick or treating is soon. Like Halloween is soon. There's gonna be trick or treating and people are gonna be dressed as clowns. Which ones are gonna be the real ones? Oh my God. Like I was actually planning on going with this one person I know, trick or treating. And I don't, I'm gonna have to call it off. I'm, gonna be, I'm just gonna text her be like, no man, I can't. Like with this clown stuff, I can't trick or treat like I'm, we're not getting candy i'm sorry like someone's gonna dress up as a clown it's gonna be like oh cool costume bro and they're like yeah i want to see where i made it in the forest over here come with me little kid nah dude <laughs> this clown stuff so if you want to know if one of these creeps are living in your area look at look at this picture of the clown sightings across america they're in a lot of states guys so, so don't don't die, please. Like, I'm not sure about how real any of this is. I just kind of heard about it on the DeFranco show and thought I'd share my opinion on just how creepy it is. I want to tell my dad about this, get his reaction, because, like, he's he's very creeped out by clowns. Basically, I don't want you guys to die, so, I mean, there are a couple of ways to survive a clown that's trying to get you. So if you're walking down the street, you're with a friend, and you see a clown, and he's like, Hey, kids, come over here, and let's go into the forest. Don't do it, all right? But here's what you can do. You stop your friend, you're like, all right, dude, I dare you to go over to that clown and see like what that's all about, like see what he wants. And if he's a little creeped out, you can just go up to him and be like, I'll be right behind you, dude. Let's just go up and talk to him. And you follow him, and then right when he gets near the clown, you book it, dude. Let the clown have that kid. Listen, I'm not saying that friends aren't important, because obviously they are, but you're a little bit more important. Anybody who watches me is the coolest of the cool, all right? You can't. I know it might be hard. And maybe you're not sad about it. Like, maybe you're just like, oh, pff, finally he's gone. He's given me a Nerf gun for my birthday since I was seven every single year. Oh my God, look. <clears throat> I'm scrolling through Twitter, all right? Like, just casually in the middle of the video, because that's what I do. Look at this tweet. It's a, it's a tweet from Sick Goat, and he just like tweeted it out randomly. And look at the meme. It's one of the clowns I was talking about. Isn't that... See what I mean? These guys are taking America by storm. I'm legit a little creeped out now. Like, those clowns look so freaky, dude. But anyway, how to survive. How to survive the clowns with TJ. And say you're alone and you're not with a friend. Best thing you can do, just avoid them. Chances are, they can't chase you down in those giant shoes. Like, you know, the giant clown shoes. So just, like... Just go, dude, go! Don't let that guy catch up to you. And say an unfortunate event happens, like you turn a corner and he's face to face with you. Okay, just pretend that was a clown. I don't really know where I'm going with this video. I'm just kind of mixing it up. Just, just bear with me. Okay, so now pretend that was like a clown. You just run into him. What are you gonna do? Like he's face to face with you, doing this creepy face that clowns tend to do. Like just staring at you, dude. Just just staring at you, dude. Just staring at you, dude. Well, then, I don't really know what you can do. Just, like, there's one thing you can do. Kinda goes against the bro code, you know? It's not something you're supposed to do to a fellow guy, but if there's a creepy clown 
like face to face with you, there's it's game over at that point. A swift kick to the nards should do it. And if it's a whole nother level of creepy and you like you hit them and they just kinda like and just don't like they just keep staring, it's over for you. Like I'm sorry, but it's over. Like <laughs> run <laughs> just just run but like if you run that guy's gonna appear like outside your house like that's a whole nother level like this clown stuff is creepy man like i don't i can't believe that it's real because it's like something out of a horror movie like it's just it's so creepy just like, watch out guys and i'm not saying it's common either i'm just saying if it does happen at least now you can survive it probably <laughs> did the microphone pick that up <laughs> hold on hold on Okay, on another note, like, this is probably after the outro or whatever. Okay, wait, what is this? Look, as I'm talking about it, I get a tweet from Metamorphix, Jake, a friend of mine. Look at this. It's, it's everywhere, guys. Like, everyone knows about it.